It has been a long journey and we have learned a lot along the way. I cannot wait to take you guys inside and show you what this place looks like now because I know you remember those colorful carpets from before and this place looks dramatically different. One thing we are going to break down and make an entire YouTube video on is the bathroom remodel. We have gotten so many questions and we're gonna break it down step by step and show you everything we did to remodel that bathroom. Feel free to ask us any questions you have. We're gonna do our best to answer everything. And we do have some episodes of our journey along the way. Check them out. Let's go check this place out. The official after tour of our first flip house. You might not recognize a single thing from before, and that's because everything is different. I'll share with you some of the different things we've done along the way. We've replaced all the windows, all the doors. We've taken out the drop ceilings and added beautiful shiplap with crown molding, brand new light fixtures in every room, square large extended baseboards, brand new waterproof vinyl floors. We've kept it pretty neutral with most of the paint colors but we did add a pop of green in the front bedroom here. We had to actually rip out the original closet that was in this room because it was made from paneling. We built a closet, added a closet system. It seems like we have just poured our entire hearts into this remodel. We could not be happier with how it turned out. The feedback, the love everybody has given us along the way really makes us feel great, gives us motivation to keep going on the days we're pretty tired. The master bedroom, we did an accent ceiling. We have one of those in our bedroom and we love it. So we knew we wanted to do it here as well. In here, we have two closets. We kept the original closets and we added a design on the doors to make it a look a little bit more modern, but keep that old feel to the old door example on the other closet. And we have actually completely disagreed what the favorite transformation is. I personally love the kitchen. Everything about it pulls together. We have the stainless and the black hardware. The gas oven is perfect. It has so many cool features like adding the blue panel light, five burners, safety features. We did the crown on the cabinet, the light above the sink, the undermount sink. We even went with quartz countertops with the gray veinage. And Trey's favorite room of the entire house is the bathroom. We have a separate video you can check out to see everything we did in this bathroom. But the green before, it is unrecognizable to what it is now. This was our first time laying a hex tile and we couldn't love it more. The built-ins in the awkward corner really showcase that area there. And then let's go check out the basement. We wanted to add some extra square foot to the house, so we ended up finishing the entire basement. We have quite a few wow factors down here, starting with the faux brick on the top wall and the parged wall on the bottom. The steps have motion lights, so as you walk down them in the night, they'll actually light up for you. We kept the original cabinet to the house and we just painted it black. We painted all the original doors black down here and really kept it with a black and white feel. We added the beadboard to the wall that is on the garage, put a stackable washer and dryer unit in, did another barn door down here and then left this area going up the steps open. You can see the parged wall. That is multiple layers of mortar. So it'll constantly hold out the moisture. 
and we added an entire full bathroom down here. First was the up flush toilet. This system actually flushes up, so we did not have to bust up the concrete. We have the standing shower stall with the beautiful glass doors that really dress this area up, especially for a basement bathroom. And then you have your block windows we added. I actually redid an old vanity and added dowels on the side to dress up the vanity. The mirror and the light fixture pull everything together down here. And bonus room in the basement, there is actually a big fourth bedroom down here that used to be a workshop, but after ripping it to shreds, a lot of new drywall, you now have a beautiful bedroom in the basement as well.